I lived with a roommate who was a total shut-in. He had a girlfriend. She wasn't long distance, but for some reason, they were just constantly on Skype with each other. He was just playing a video game with her on the corner of his computer screen. His computer was perfectly facing my bed. Every single time I went to sleep, his girlfriend's face would just be staring blankly toward me as I was like changing and getting ready for bed. And she lived like a building over. There was no reason they had to do that. I'm trying to eat my, my Frosted Flakes and he's talking about all the deranged sex acts he wants to do. All of the ladies, all of all different kinds of ladies. He would not stop talking about how his biggest fantasy was going to a strip club and having a stripper step on his balls. And I wanna do a movie that's like 300, man, with like chicks that are just like stepping on guys' balls. There was one time where I walked into the apartment and ended up seeing him with a lady and was whipping her and he had the 300 soundtrack playing. Everybody's cool to like what they like. I'm trying to go to bed. I don't need to know about this. When she was home, she kind of always had guys around. Sometimes she wouldn't have enough money for the bills, but she would be like Instagramming her going out to like steak dinners. Always wore heels. How did you get those shoes, by the way? Those are like $5,000 shoes. I opened up like her armoire. From top to bottom shelf, she had expensive, beautiful, matching lingerie. I pretty much knew 100% that my roommate was a high-class escort. I come back from holiday break one time and all of her stuff has gotten out of the apartment. I was 24 and I had a roommate move in and to celebrate we sat <clears throat> in the living room and had a few drinks. She proceeded to drink all of the drinks and then took her shirt off, played with her nipples, put her head up in the air, projectile volcano vomited all over herself and the couch and then passed out. That was within about 45 minutes of meeting her. 